Why use Flame? Flame is a Flutter 2D game framework. You can use the Flutter widgets within your Flame game. These are Flutter text widgets. There are, if you like Flutter and you like Dart and you want to use the Flutter development workflow to build your game, Flame may be of interest to you. If you're just getting started with mobile app development, you may want to use a more mature framework with more extensive documentation. If you already know something like Unity, uh, this is the Unity editor on the right, uh, then you're probably better off just staying with Unity. Again, Flutter and Flame are for people that they, they like the development workflow of Dart and Flutter and the way the Dart language is. If you're using JavaScript, there's Phaser is quite good. So I would recommend maybe looking at some, there's other frameworks, but Phaser is good. Focus on these text buttons and change them to icon buttons in this demonstration. This is just to show you how easy it is to create a icon button and include those Flutter widgets inside of your Flame game. So we're gonna take the existing text button, change it to a standard icon button in Flutter. And as you probably know, there's these great uh, material icons in there that's already built into Flutter. So you don't even have to import the icons to get access. We can now change the right button. We can change the color of the icon button, the size of the button, all with that great hot restart workflow on Flutter. It's fun and it's awesome. For more information on Flame, go to their main flame-engine.org site. I think this tagline describes the advantage. Uh, it's a 2D game engine, so it's not 3D, it's not like Unity, and it's built on top of Flutter. This is what I'm looking for. Uh, if it's what you're looking for, uh, give it a go. For a 2D game engine, it has the audio, the rendering. Uh, there's some nice helper functions here. Uh, that you can get a lot of the stuff done. So give it a try and see whether you like it or not. Um, subscribe to this. We'll be updating the previous mobile game. We'll be continuing it with that one. And um, add collision detection, uh, platforms, other things to it.